in his grand design when God first created man, he created a duality of the sexes. The ennobling expression of that duality is found in marriage. One individual is complementary to the other. As Paul stated, neither is the man without the woman, neither the woman without the man in the Lord. Man and woman are his creations. Their duality is his design. One is incomplete without the other. I recognize that we have many wonderful women among us who do not have the opportunity of marriage, but they too make such a tremendous contribution. There are some men who in a spirit of arrogance think they are superior to women. They do not seem to realize that they would not exist but for the mother who gave them birth. Every woman is a daughter of God. You cannot offend her without offending him. The women in our lives are, tre are creatures endowed with particular qualities, divine qualities, which cause them to reach out in kindness and with love to those about them. We can encourage that outreach if we will give them opportunity to give expression to the talents and impulses that lie within them. In our old age, my beloved companion said to me quietly one evening, you've always given me wings to fly, and I've loved you for it. Women are such a necessary part of the plan of happiness which our Heavenly Father has outlined for us. That plan cannot operate without them. How thankful I am, how thankful we all must be for the women in our lives. God bless them.